Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another Sunday reset. I am already up and moving this morning um, and I'm trying to prepare dinner for later on tonight. Um, I'm going to be doing a pot roast for today, Sunday's dinner, um, and it'll be ready. Usually I know people eat Sunday dinner earlier, but we're doing it late today. Um, and then I went to the farmer's market yet, or the market yesterday, where we have like a little like farm stand, little thing that we have in the area so I went there and then we also went to this farm that's nearby a local farm that has fresh fruits and vegetables um, that I want to kind of show you guys what we got um, I've been saving everything I didn't even unpack it um, yesterday because I wanted to show you all what we got but we scored pretty good um, first we got some fresh uh, freshly picked um, blackberries and they look amazing um, and then I've got some kind of loud <laughs> we've got some sweet potatoes i'm gonna make a sweet potato pie i just realized i don't know where that crust is anything and then in this little bag here and it's so cute i've got some fresh a fresh onion guys an onion that was just picked um i got some okra I think of okra some potatoes to put in my pot roast for today and then a large tomato. I was gonna make a like a crazy salad, so I'm gonna use that. So cute. Um, we've got some zucchini. I've got some little cucumbers here. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but I just cucumber. And then I got some peaches. I feel like I'm cheating on my. I feel like I'm cheating on my family because we. My dad is from an area in Georgia where our peaches are like. That's where peaches are produced. And I'm pretty sure like most, almost all the peaches in Georgia and probably South Carolina are bought from there. <laughs> and then we always get like free peaches all the time. Um, but we got, I got some peaches and I think this is it. Some dates. Um, and then obviously the meat, <laughs> the meat for the pot roast. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't think everybody wants to see that. But yeah, let me get started on the pot roast so I can go ahead and get that going. Let's heat up the slow cooker um so for today's sunday reset i really want to show you all how i um prep like food wise for the week um i'm like in this i think i've kind of touched on a, a little bit i'm in this like it's more simple um lifestyle change right now and and it's and especially when it comes to my food and like what i'm putting in my body um, so I've been starting, I've started to make more things like I made jelly the other day, like jelly from strawberries, fresh strawberries. Like who am I? Um, I'm going to try to make butter today. I've been making bread every week. It's just great. So I'll show you all how I've been making my bread. <laughs> I want to preface by saying yes I am like in this minimal simple trying to like cut out certain things like incorporate more uh, like a healthier version of things or just a healthier way of living I guess I would say um, and that doesn't go to show like that doesn't mean that I don't like 
not have things that are not necessarily healthy to some or whatever. And I'm still in the very beginning process of this new journey. So obviously I still have things, um, you know, that aren't organic or something still in my house. I'm still using packets of Lipton onion soup. Like I, I don't want to waste things. Obviously I probably won't buy it anymore. Um, but um, I don't want to waste things. I still want, I'm going to use up what I have. So for all you people, I know it's going to be somebody who thinks it. Um, yeah, I know I used packaged Lipton onion soup and pepperoncinis that, you know, I may not be able to let go of pepperoncinis. I'm going to have to figure out how to make that myself. <laughs> Um, because I am a sucker for pepperoncinis. I am going to start growing those types of peppers, so to be determined. Uh, I'm like really struggling trying to get this. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so I'm going to wash uh, my produce and yeah. my bed because it is time to switch out the sheets and then do some laundry so also watching thousand pound sisters my favorite dark um i'm making my ras not raspberry blackberry syrup right now so right now they're settling i'm just drawing the liquid out of it right now so i tried to do the butter i think it's just too um let me see you guys up here i think it's too cold in here um i did put it i brought it from the fridge and then i just started whipping it which i think eventually it should have warmed up but it didn't, it, which is fine. Um, I'll have to like try it, try it another time. I just don't have the patience for it. It's it's a lot more work than I intended. Um, so I just ended up just whipping it enough for it to become. Um, and I was at it for like over an hour. By, like by the way, this thing was like turning for an hour in the mixer. Uh, I don't know. I think the mixer maybe may not go fast enough as fast as it, as it needs to. So I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna make ice cream. So I put a little bit of vanilla and sugar in it, and then popped it, popped the mason mason jar in the freezer. So that's that's what's happening. A little bit later in the day, makeup is off, the eyebrows are off, and I kind of changed. I changed my shorts or my bottoms. Um, but I'm gonna get into baking the bread for the week. Um, and then finishing, I started this blackberry syrup. I just wasn't sure, I wasn't sure what I was gonna do with the blackberries. So I think, since I already have like too much jam that I made the other day, I'm going to make like a syrup that I can put in drinks, like cocktails or something like that. So I think that's what we're gonna do. Um, dinner is finishing up. Let me cut this on there. Yeah, so. Bread. bread takes about like a couple hours or so probably a little bit longer um just due to the having to let the bread rise um so let me get my bowl it looks pretty good just have to be patient and let it all reduce down and then you can start mashing 